Gallo and Brett Gardner. So we'll get through these quickly. Who has the first question? Meredith, please unmute. Aaron, just what did you think of the effort by Corey Kluber tonight? Uh, greater on, you know, that's, that's what Corey does. Great effort all around, um, locating his pitches, um, attacking the zone, you know, getting to, you know, leverage counts. He's able to kind of sling that slider in there and just kind of have it fall off the table. It's pretty, uh, pretty impressive, but just, you know, he set the tone for us tonight and, you know, we kind of fed off his energy and, you know, kept it rolling. Two home runs for Joey Gallo tonight. He told me on the field, he's feeling more, more confident, more comfortable. What's look different um, from your vantage point about, about the way he's approaching things? I think just getting pitches to hit, you know, you got a guy like Joey Gallo a lot of the times, so, uh, you know, he's got such a great eye and he works to count really well. Sometimes he doesn't get a lot of pitches to hit. And, you know, as a hitter, that's frustrating. You know, sometimes you try to do a little too much when you're, you know, walking a lot or not getting pitches to drive. So I just think tonight he kept it simple. And, you know, when he got a pitch out over the plate, you know, he was able to crush it. It seems like it's been a bit of a roller coaster ride, not only the, for the team, but really for the offense in general. Just what could a night like this with a lot of home runs, a lot of production from the offense do for you guys in the final 14? Uh, you know, we just take it one day at a time. You know, I think, uh, you know, tonight was great. You know, we were able to produce a lot. Uh, it was kind of, you know, just a two-run ball game there from the majority of the game. And then, you know, we were able to break out with Guardi's home run. But uh, you know, I think if this team just keeps taking it one day at a time and just playing for one game and just kind of keep that mentality, I think we're going to be a good position um, here down the stretch. Brendan Cuddy, you have the next question. Aaron, could you take us through your double play? what you saw there and, and what you know, just what, what went on there? Uh, those are fun ones, you know, when they're kind of hanging up there and especially Yankee Stadium, it's so uh, short to ride. I can play in, um, you know, fairly, <laughs> fairly shallow, you know, but a lot of teams aren't used to that, you know, coming from other ball is pretty big. So, uh, you know, I'm just kind of reading the runner, uh, watching where he's at and he's kind of holding up, holding up. And I try to make it look like, you know, I'm not going to catch it. And then, you know, Rizzo did a good job staying on the base and gave me a good target and able to get the double play. Those are, uh, I like doing that. <laughs> did you feel pretty confident when, when you let it go? Uh, no, you never do. Uh, those are the, the tricky ones. You know, it's kind of like a touch pass because you, you hear the crowd behind you and you want to get it there in time to beat the runner. And, you know, majority of the time, you know, usually eight out of 10 times, you're going to sail it over the first baseman's head. Um, but, you know, that that was, Two out of the 10 were, you know, get right to them and we're able to get the play. Thanks. Max Goodman, you have the next question. Aaron, you mentioned Gardner. How much of an impact has he had on this offense, not just this week, but really all of the second half of the year? Uh, he's, he's been huge for us. You know, if it's uh, him batting at the bottom of the order and kind of keeping things rolling and kind of turn over that lineup, or, you know, if it's him leading off for us and, you know, it's kind of being that spark, that fire plug that he is and, you know, getting this offense going, you know, he's been, been huge offensively coming up with some big hits for us. You know, he had a couple big hits in Baltimore, um, had some walk-offs earlier this year. And then like like tonight, you know, it's a close ball game. Just haven't had that one, you know, one swing to kind of put us, pull us apart from the Indians. And, you know, sure enough, he comes up and it's that three-run homer and, you know, kind of calms everybody down, you know. So um, uh, he's uh, he's been, you know, a spark plug for us, especially in the second half. Thank you. Aaron, thank you. We'll be back in a moment. Thanks, fellas. See you in the morning.